Nintendo Switch. Okay, so this is such a creative idea, uh, having basically, who, who, what's Nintendo best at? The 3DS and their mobile consoles. They know they can't really do heavy hitting with some of the, the, the you know, Sony and Microsoft. They've, they've always had either, you know, little or uh, fewer graphics or, you know, some sort of power deficiency. But they've always been uh, amazing, uh, you know, on the go. And uh, so to actually get an entire console experience out of it, yeah, it depends on how powerful this is. There is the danger that this could, you know, uh, turn into, say, another PlayStation Vita, which didn't work out too well. Sony didn't support it, but I don't think so because Nintendo uh, isn't like Sony. They, they do support their games and they want it yeah. to be successful. And even if sales are low, they're going to push all their very popular first-party titles out on this. I like these 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 controllers that they got, which you can pull off and, and you know... I like the idea. Like Let's look at it. Because the, this does... Ooh, I don't know, man. They look like going it. crab hands. So I, I'd have to hold this first, but it does look incredibly uncomfortable. And so, you know, it, it looks to have the same graphics, the same horsepower. It pretty much seems to be the same console. You know, it's coming out March 2017. That's cool. It was in the trailer. It's a tablet that you can also plug into your TV. That is fun. I've always wanted to see my. I've always wanted to take my 3DS and plug it into the television or to my. You know, have functionality with the Wii U. When you're playing at home, it sits in a docking station that plugs directly into your TV. You play games like a conventional console. Then you pull the Switch out of the dock and immediately transform into the handheld device that offers the exact same experience on a small screen. All right, so there it is, the exact same experience. Okay, that's good. Uh, it even has a kickstand, so it'll stand up on its own. I love the things that have a kickstand, so that's going to be super awesome for plain uh, trays. Uh, multiple controller options. It wouldn't be a modern Nintendo. Mini controllers with the switch joy cons they do the joy cons one player can use a joy con controller and two players can each take one joy con and everybody can have multiple joy cons uh nintendo uh you could put the joy con controllers back onto the system or into a grip accessory the nintendo says mirrors the configuration of a more traditional controller uh cartridge base just like the 3ds reveal confirmed earlier uh that games will come on small cartridges so i'm i'm not sure how much information you can then put on a cartridge they're they're definitely not coming over here with the blu-rays and 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 again trying to compete with the big boys they're going to do their own thing this is a combination of their of their console division and their mobile division this is quite interesting yeah, it's almost there. Really it's almost like the getting out of the con the full on console market. This is a this is a change. Uh, it, you know, Nintendo always innovates, and so I can respect them for that. Uh, we get a brief glimpse at the game being plugged in in the slot. Uh, it's handheld that it boasts graphics like a full console. Uh, the chip maker posted a blog at the same time confirming rumors that it's powered by the performance of a Tegra processor. Uh, <clears throat> NVIDIA GPU based, same architecture as the GeForce game and graphics card. So nice. hopefully that's going to lead to uh, some, some good ports and multi-platform titles. But you have to wonder, uh, is it... It, it'll have less power than some of the other consoles, so the, some of the new games will they be coming out. Yes, it can handle Skyrim, but Skyrim came out X amount of years ago, so uh, there are some still some questions there. And I think you, you'll, you'll increase your sales, and I think that would be incredibly cool. Uh, but it looks like, you know, the fat of 3D is over. They didn't include it in their new console. They didn't bother to make this huge screen 3D. No. Uh, all right, so that is the Nintendo... Uh, Switch, it's coming March uh, 2017, which is pretty soon.